Consumer alert out of Webster County. Independence Bank says 14 people received counterfeit $100 bills out of their Providence location ATMs. Jordan Yady joins us with the details. Well, Brianne, Randy, when you take money out of a bank's ATM, you expect that cash to be real. But that wasn't the case for customers at Providence's Independence Bank over the holiday weekend, getting money made for the movies instead of for spending. It's like something out of a movie. It felt real, looked real, like a new crisp $100 bill. Tiffany Vaughn was just looking for some extra cash over the holiday weekend. When she and her husband got the money, they were in for a surprise. At first glance, everything seems fine. But when Vaughn looked closer, she saw this. A line on the bill saying, for motion picture purposes and in props we trust. It was not, wasn't just me, it was like several people that had went to that bank and pulled out hundreds. Me, I'm thinking that every single hundred dollar bill in there is a fake. Independence Bank says 14 people received counterfeit $100 bills out of their Providence ATM over the holiday weekend. The bank apologized for the inconvenience and said once they learned about the issue, they closed the ATM and started contacting customers and their ATM vendor. Vaughn was one of those 14 who learned the hard way that her money was counterfeit. It wasn't until about 9 o'clock that night that we figured out that they were fake. That's when Vaughn says her husband tried to spend the money and was denied. Independence Bank says they're working with the affected customers to ensure they receive legitimate money. As for the ATM, the question now turns to the vendor that manages the machines and how the fake movie money ended up in a real bank's ATM. Well, Vaughn tells me the bank has already fixed the issue, giving her the money that she intended to take out of the ATM in the first place. You can read Independence Bank's full statement right now on our website, 14news.com.